Guys, welcome back to how to maximize in this video i'm going to show you how to add custom payment method in woocommerce right so basically you can see here that i have opened two tabs that is uh, one is a woocommerce you have to just visit this website that is called woocommerce right and you have to make a new id and here you can see option that is uh, shown a uh, start a new store so just click on start a new store and after that it will redirect to here and basically you have to your enter your email address right so i will just copy this email address and i will just enter here and after that you have to enter the username so i will do the same thing here just enter your username according to you and after that we have to enter the password right and after entering the password just click on the get started and you can also get started with your uh, google or you can or with the apple id right so this is pretty easy and it will take a very few seconds just to log in so we till that time we will create a wordpress account right so just click on the wordpress here you have to just go to google and try wordpress and basically we, you have to do the same thing here you have to just make a account right and here you have to get an option where you will see that where you can make a account and here you can if you click on the my site you will get the option that is called a create a site and here basically you have to search a domain so let's say I will just skip any shop domain for example and you have to purchase it right so i will just go with the free version right so basically uh, we will select here free i will click on the choose my domain later and after that click on start with a free so uh, just for tutorial i'm just clicking with the start uh, basically if you're starting it out then you have to go through by uh, purchasing your own domain domain right and here you have to select it what you're going to do so i'm going to sell a product here so i will click continue and for example i will just uh, write here that is uh, it's a home and garden and just for tutorial i'm selecting right and if you want to skip you can skip it but don't skip it uh, right now i will just wait and basically we have to start a simple store so just click on start a simple store and we have to select the templates here so basically just for tutorial i will select this one and here you can see so just click on the unlock theme and basically this is a purchased one so a paid one so you have to purchase right so i'll just go back and again i will click uh, skip for now and basically our this uh, woocommerce has been started right so we will just click on the continue and if you just want to add this all this kind of stuff you can do it and basically i don't want to do it so i'll just go back here and i will skip this step right and basically right now i can't skip it so i will shop uh, for example x y z or shop right so i will just just for tutorial and industry clothing and accessories and business located uh, let's say yeah and just click on the continue right and here basically you have to pay for the woocommerce and right now i can't do it uh, just for tutorials i will just skip it so if you want to properly set up your woocommerce so just click on here on the left side you will see that woocommerce so just click on the woocommerce here and you have to verify this right so i will just click on here and we have to verify through the email address so you can see here that i have already verified my uh, my store now click on the woocommerce and here you will get option that is called start a new store so just click on start a new store and here you have to enter all the details for example i will just enter here anything just for example and it can be anything and just click on the continue right and it's a physical product and just click on the continue again so basically if you want to change your domain you can do here and it's saying it so i'll just click on the confirm here because uh, it, this is video just for tutorial right so right now basically we have to create a post here so just click on the post and i will click on a new post and here we have to select the template and i will just just for example i will just click on the publish here and it will get published right and basically if you want to do both changes you can just go to the google and after that you can just go to the woocommerce website and just hit the enter and after that just click on the first link and here you will enter the woocommerce and you can just get more plugins and all that right so here you can see all the extensions and all that so for example if you want to search for any extension just go to the payment and click on the payment and here you can see that all the extensions that you required the plugins that you required to install in your page so uh, right now uh, if i just want a payment processor and a gateway so i will click here and you can see just a wait a second and here you can see all this for example i will always choose a stripe or you can see the paypal and here you have to download it right so basically you have to downloading it and you have to attach this plugin to your store so right now just click on the proceed to checkout and here you have to enter all details and you have to buy it right and after buying you have to just go to the uh, 
So you have to just go to the, this website and here you have to in the wordpress you have to enter the payment right in this way you will able to attach the gateway and this is pretty easy guys in the initially you will find some kind of issues or some kind of confusion so just watch the video from the starting and follow each and step pro properly i hope you enjoyed this video and make sure to like this video subscribe channel and see you guys in the next video thanks for watching thanks for watching